Welcome back, fart sniffers. We are back. Pretty good outdoors is back. Green Valley Lake. Green Valley Lake. Very near and dear place to us. Grew up coming here as children. Yeah, stoked to be here. Gonna hopefully get on some trout. Oh yeah. It just opened up on Monday. So we had yeah. quite a journey getting here. <laughs> so this guy decides like, oh yeah, we are, we're at like a quarter tank. We can make it up the mountain. So we start driving and we just start hearing duh, 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 duh. and the freaking um, the truck just stops and it does not. He ran out of gas and we were not even on a like a pull off. So we're in the middle of the road. It's a one lane. <laughs> and um, so he's restarted the car. We were able to pull off and we were stuck there for like 30 minutes. We got here super late. Some nice guys. Good came. Samaritans, yes, guys. Good Samaritans. Some good Samaritans out there. Shout out to you guys. Some guy in a white minivan picked yeah. us up, drove us, drove us a mile to the gas station, and yes. then a nice gentleman in a golden Tacoma took us back to our truck with the jerry can. So yeah, it worked out. Thank God. People are so nice up here. I know. Definitely yeah. recommend coming here. We yeah. haven't fished yet, but yeah. we'll see. We'll see. Saw some fish jumping. Yeah, some people have some already. So we'll get back to you guys. Stay gotcha. tuned. Come on. Come on. Come on, Come on. My thing is literally caught. I have one right now. My freaking line got snagged on my rod. Uh, just uh. The trout, little trout nugget. Oh, that's not that size. Oh, I just popped off. What? Dude, my freaking bobber got all caught up and there's a knot. Well, I know what they're hitting on now.
me out, ladies and gentlemen. First one of the day. Not a bad boy. About a pound and a half. No, I feel it. Come on, baby. I'm bringing it over here because the weeds. Ooh, it's got some tuglage. The crappie? <laughs> you have a net? Oh, it's a small guy. Don't. And another one. Second one of the day. Dude, get the net, get the net, get the net. Look at this guy. Get the net. Not ready whatsoever. You ready? Bring it, bring it, bring it. Right here, right here, right here. Dude, I swear if this thing gets off because of you. I can't believe I did that from freaking trolling. For what? Mini jig. Yes. We should just start doing that. Gotta get the freaking net. Oh my gosh. Whoa. No, he's not. Pull thinker, pull thinker, pull thinker. Dude, pull it up, pull it up. Right here, right here, get the net. Don't pull on the line. Get it, get it, get it. Yeah, baby! You just cut my line? You just cut my line. Of course I did, Oh. Dude, that's a pig. That's a pig. Fuck up, bait, baby. Ooh, yeah. About a pound? No, that's not like two or three even. Walked in at two pounds and two ounces. Is oh. it sitting there? Yeah. On the crappie. I was like, why does my thing feel so heavy? On the crappie. I'm scared to hold this thing. You did? Yeah. Crappie for days, baby. Beautiful crappie. Crappie for days. I'm gonna fry this boy. Have some golden crispies. You. I'm dropping it, jumping over. Ooh. Got a score. Dude, on the drop, dude, I wasn't even reeling it. The 
Fish are acclimated, guys. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. There you go, you got a little fighter. Does that feel a lot better than Silverwood? Yeah. Oh, you choked it. Watch me have a fish on the fly on the fly. <laughs> Bring that boy in. He does not want to give up. Ooh. That was insane. Coming this way. He is not giving up. Pissed off Puerto Rican, man. Come on, buddy. Just give up. Oh my god. Ooh. Oh my. He's feisty. This is awesome. <laughs> this is the hardest fight in two pound of earth cod, dude. That guy. Oh yeah. He might look way bigger. Oh, 2.22. <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, so update. No one has four trout, three trout. Uh, four. Four trout. Almost five. One crappie. I've got two trout, one crappie. Some meaty ones, 2.2 and 2.3. Not not too big, but you know, we've been fishing Silverwood Lake the past couple weeks and uh feels nice to have an actual tug and catch something bigger than 0.75 pounds. So yeah, no one's hitting the fly rod right now. Fish are hopping off for flies laying on top of the wire, so he's getting her done. Yeah guys. Some good fishing out here at Green Valley Lake. Got a little story time for you. One time back when, back in the day when we were younger, I want to say I was like nine, maybe eight. No one was four. four or five. And we were here with our family. So we're all chilling, fishing early in the morning, Sash. All got our Shakespeare uh, ugly sticks out. <laughs> my sister, so my sister, she's what? Probably like 12, 13. She's her and her uh, pink ugly stick. Got it in the, posted in the rod holder. Then all of a sudden, I kid you not, the pole almost slides into the water. Gets yanked out of the pole holder, starts sliding into the water. She runs and grabs it, and she's cranking on this thing for like 10 minutes. It shows itself. It jumps out of the water, right? She almost landed it. Shows itself. And then right as it was coming on the shore, we see it jump, and it is probably like, probably a double digit largemouth bass. I think she was using the night crawler, <laughs> but almost landed it. So this place has pigs, man. They stock it good. A little, little pricey, twenty-five dollars for a pass. But yeah, definitely worth checking out. It's beautiful out here. Nice little small lake. Rowboats. No motorboats. Kind of sucks, but you know, gotta deal with the hand you're dealt. So yeah, guys. A good one. Get the net ready, guy. Oh, he's coming. It's coming in easy, dude. Get the net ready, guys. Right here. I'm reeling in. You don't need to. This is a chunky one, dude. Come on. It's right here. 
right here. Exactly. Oh no. Dude, that's a chunk. This is a big one, dude. That's definitely the biggest one. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Three pounder, dude. That's a shabby. Brad, boom. Chunker. For sure, the biggest. How much is it? I don't know. That's not going in there. Oh, yep. 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 Three. Yep, three on the dot, dude. Really? Yeah. Three pounder. Not bad for this lady. Yeah, seriously. Pretty good outdoors, ladies and gentlemen. Way. Oh, hogs. Pretty good outdoors. <laughs> Catching hogs. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. It's a wrap. Another successful episode of Pretty Good Outdoors. Yes. Green Valley Lake produced, let me tell you guys. Great time. Yeah, the bite was like on and off throughout the whole day. It was pretty crazy. Yeah, we started off on the shore right next to the dam. Had some luck there. Nolan caught two right off the bat with on like uh, like power bait nuggets. Yeah, the little trout nuggets. And then I walked around to the little cove right there and I caught got on a like a two pound trout and then a little, little white crappie and then we we're just like screw it let's get a boat man and so we got a boat a little row boat it was a pain in the ass let me tell you but <laughs> the wind started kicking the against our rows <laughs> and it was a struggle yeah man, i didn't know i signed up for the row team <laughs> green valley lake but anyways yeah then we got on the boat we kind of slow no one caught one Randomly just threw out a little mini jig while we were rowing Tro Trolling uh, mini jigs is the new thing guys. So. Yeah, we literally trolled a mini jig I just threw it out for fun while we were rowing. I was like dude, why not? And literally like three rows in it just my pole just starts bending like crazy Yeah, right, that one was uh, what 2.3? Yeah, that was my biggest one is 2.3 yeah. um, They were jumping everywhere. There's flies all on the water. So we grabbed the fly rod. That was fun. So, give us a flat roll. We're not too experienced, so don't oh, judge yeah. us. <laughs> Complete beginners. But yeah, I'm a, I was using Austin's. I want to get my own. We might start trying to fly fish for the channel. Yeah. So yeah. Do some new things. And then we got on a couple. Nolan got on a, a white, another white crappie. He's gonna cook yeah. that thing up for the Oh good. yeah. Some golden crispies. And then I got out by the dam right in the middle. Got lucky and caught two, two uh, bows. One was a 2.2 and the other was a three pounder. Biggest of the day. So we each caught the same amount of fish and the yeah. same kind of fish. So I had, yeah, you'll see the footage, but at the very, very beginning, we already had a really rough morning with oh my get, having the truck die. And then right when I get there, I cast out the bait and weight and my, I got like a fish literally right away, right when I cast it. And I was mini jigging a little bit farther down, so I started running to my thing, and I noticed that my bobber tied all around my whole pole and knotted, so I couldn't even reel in. So I had the hand pull it, got right to shore, right when I was about to put my hand on it, it broke off and swam away. Back to the old days, man. Yep. And 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 reeling in. Seriously. Yeah. So I was like, all right, this day is gonna be terrible. It pulled through. It did. Thank God. Rough start to the morning, guys. Let really rough. It. Didn't even think we were gonna make it to fishing. So. I literally snapped my pole, putting my poles inside of Austin's truck. Yep. My Snap. brand new pole snapped the tip of it. What a rough morning, man. Very rough morning. So. so yeah. Glad still, I came through. Oh yeah. So we got on some fish. Thank God. Yeah. So yeah, I think uh, we're gonna try to hit Gregory for the last stock. We'll see. It's such a pain driving up here. It's like two hours for us. Yeah. But it's like the last last. Place the sox trout, so yeah, getting home is a pain. Yeah, yeah right now, right really now we're just gonna get slammed with traffic. Yeah, but yeah, then after that, we might switch over to ocean fishing. Yeah, might see some ocean action right next to us. So, yeah, catch some spotties, maybe some, some hallies, you know. Yeah, we'll see. But thanks, guys, thanks for watching. As always, swipe up, like, subscribe. 
Yeah, leave a comment. Leave a comment. All right, guys. See you in the Until morning. Until next time, pretty good outdoors out. Signing off.